and as we go through the uh, overnight, I think low temperatures are going to end up somewhere in the uh, mid-30s. So overnight uh, and late this evening, numbers dropping into the 40s here. Uh, 49 in Hartwick, low 50s, Cooperstown, and up north, temperatures here falling back uh, to near 40. Back edge of the rain now working its way to the east. We go in a little bit closer still, uh, dealing with some light rain here in Utica. Down to the south, a stripe of uh, steadier rain from Milford to Oneonta, just north of the uh, 88 corridor. Then we go into the weekend, and here comes the cooler air filling in. There's this little disturbance to the north that's going to swing through on Sunday with a passing rain or snow shower through the course of the day. So the wet weather moving away, a little bit of clearing uh, possible by later tonight. And did you know that parts of central New York are considered abnormally dry, a little bit of a drought, but that's nothing compared to the uh, extreme and exceptional drought down here across Dixie. Uh, with an El Nino winter, though, this will likely change. So uh, just uh, we'll keep an eye on that. So upper 30s and low 40s through the day tomorrow, mixture of clouds and sunshine. Uh, Seago County, same deal, uh, partly to mostly sunny by afternoon. Temperatures upper 30s to near 40, and we're in the low 40s at Herkimer. Let's fast forward and talk about travel weather. So as we head into late Tuesday, uh, temperatures going to be marginally cold enough for some rain and or light wintry mix or wet snow before changing over to rain Tuesday night into Wednesday and then up north on Wednesday afternoon into Thanksgiving there will be lake effect snow developing. Cold turkey for Thanksgiving. Nothing worse than snow flurries here locally and then bright sunshine but staying cold as we head into Black Friday. But on Thanksgiving Day, with the sufficiently colder air moving over the still relatively warm lakes, east of Lake Ontario and south of Buffalo, the south towns, uh, the lee side Lake Erie, we could see some plowable snow for the lake belts on Thanksgiving Day. Not here, though. We'll keep you posted how the wind direction will evolve because a small wind shift Makes all the difference. Rain tapers tonight, turning colder. And then through the day tomorrow, partly to mostly sunny. Nice day, but chilly. A high of 43. Seven day forecast, uh, rain or wet snow shower Sunday. No accumulation, except over higher elevations. Maybe a slushy coating on the grassy surfaces. Cold and bright Monday. Again, watching that system Tuesday. Starts as rain or a little light wintry mix or wet snow. Changes to rain. And then we go the other way on Wednesday as temperatures drop with lake effect snow developing north and then over far southwestern New York. Some of that snow could pile up into Thursday. Again, not here locally, but if you have to head up towards Watertown or west to Buffalo, uh, that's where it could be a little bit impactful and we stay cold into Black Friday. All right, Craig, thank you. Next after this break, a Utica area OBGYN staying in prison. The latest on Dr. Newlander's murder conviction appeal coming up.